Good morning, everyone. Boys are eating. The kitties are eating. Let me show you Merlin. Uh oh, Mazzy. Your bowl's going under the rug. Let me show you Merlin out here. It's freezing in the house, you guys. It's freezing. Let's see if Mama Merlin's still eating here. Yeah, Merlin's over here. I still have to keep Merlin in his uh, kitty condo when he eats because um, he tries to get the boys' food. <laughs> we just keep him separated from now for for now. Um, hopefully, when he gets older, he'll be like kitten and uh, stay with his own food bowl. Uh, we'll see how it works. Everybody's done already? Everybody's done? Yes, it's freezing in the house, you guys. I'm still not feeling good. Um, not as bad. My nose is still a little plugged. <laughs> but last night, I, it, it was so cold in here. We have this old thermostat. Look at I've got the heat all the way <laughs> as far as it can go. And look what it says the temperature is, you guys. It is freezing in the house. I told my husband, I said, you've got to go, or you've got to call someone because it is so cold. I don't know what's going on. Um, oops, I'm trying to turn that light off. We haven't had a problem in the house until last night. <coughs> and it's not good because I'm still trying to get better oh, from this cold I have. <clears throat> so... Marley, stop sniffing him there. Stop sniffing him there. No, no. I've got sweats on. I've got fuzzy socks on. Um, <clears throat> I still feel like I need another sweatshirt on. <laughs> I'm so cold. So I just woke up because I barely slept. <clears throat> um, as I kept waking up being so cold, I think I'm going to run. What are you doing? Are you getting a kitty toy? He loves these kitty toys here. Let me show you what they are. Oh, there's a spider there. Step on that thing, kill it. Okay. <laughs> um, he loves these little plastic balls that have this little like other plastic ball in it. Um, he doesn't break them or anything, but he loves these things. He plays like I'm like with them like he's a kitty, like pushes them around and stuff. It's so funny. Let's see if he'll do it. Oh, you just gonna pick it up? You just gonna pick it up? At least the sun's out today a little bit. See the sunshine on the floor? At least the sun's out a little. Maybe it'll heat the house up. Maybe it'll heat this front room up and I can just sit out there with a blanket. I had this blanket wrapped around me last night. I think I'm going to run to Meyer, and um, if my husband can't get someone out here today, I think I'm going to run to Meyer and get a couple. Oh, stop. He doesn't like anybody by him. <laughs> He's so silly. Yes, you are. You're so silly. He doesn't ever do anything. He just is vocal and growls a little like, don't go by me. And you don't care, do you? You still go by him. You don't care. Yes, you don't care. No. I still got to brush their faces. Just woke up, got out of bed. Anyways, I think I'm going to go buy a couple of electric blankets, heated blankets, um, for tonight in case, uh, someone can't come today to look at our furnace. Anyways, all right, guys. Um, I just wanted to do kind of a little check in today since I haven't been on, since I haven't been feeling good. I left the, um, and I need to get a Kleenex because my nose is starting to run. Kleenex everywhere <laughs> in the house. <clears throat> um, I came home from my family party this weekend, and I could tell at my family party, um, my throat was feeling a little scratchy, and I thought maybe it's because I'm talking too much. <coughs> because I, um, you get together with family and you just start talking, and I thought maybe my throat's just dry, maybe it's just irritated because I'm talking too much. Um, no, I came home and my throat started to hurt. I just started to feel really ter terrible. And next day I woke up and it was just like, oh, Lord, no, please, no. 
and I've had a cold for the past couple days, <clears throat> but it is getting better. Thank goodness. So, um, <coughs> I just had a little cough and my nose runs a little bit. My voice still sounds a little hoarse, like scratchy, but I am starting to feel a little better at least. So hopefully this cold house isn't going to make it worse because I got a lot to do. I've got to make cookies. I've got, I've got a lot to do before Christmas still. Look at that kitty. What are you doing, Truman? What are you doing, kitten? You seeing if he ate all his breakfast? Are you seeing if he ate all his breakfast? <laughs> Sometimes um, Merlin will leave a little couple morsels behind and kitten has to go in and check it out. <laughs> all right, I've got some cards and some packages I want to share with you guys that I've gotten um, since the last video I made. So. I'm going to um, eat some breakfast, get myself together, and share those with you. All right, guys, I'm in my bedroom because it's later on in the afternoon. I think it's about 1.30. I just got done feeding the boys their lunch, and um, my husband is home, and we are waiting on a heating and cooling company. I was going to come check our furnace out and hopefully change this old thermostat. The thermostat still says it's 60 degrees in here. Um, it feels a little warmer to me, but I don't know if it's just from the sun beating down on the house, which I'm thankful the sun's finally out today. It's so funny. Like when you live in Michigan and you don't see the sun for a while and the sun's out. So I got sunglasses on my head because um, I got to get going out. You got to have sunglasses because that sun just you're, you're not used to it and when it's bright like that it just blinds you <laughs> especially if there was snow on the ground there's no I mean there's a hint of snow here and there but there's really no snow on the ground um so when that sun comes out and it, and it shines down on snow if it was snowy it's even worse so <laughs> thank goodness for the sun I'm not complaining because it heated it up and plus I've been cleaning and mopping floors and vacuuming so I'm a little heated up anyways so Hopefully they can figure out what's wrong with our um, furnace. Looks like my camera is going in and out. I apologize, guys. Okay, so I wanted to share some packages I got and some Christmas cards I got since the last time I was on here. Um, my daughter, um, I was feeling like crap. What's today, Thursday? I was feeling like crap Monday. I mean, just crap. I was on the couch all day. The boys were just laying with me on the couch. And... Uh, it was just one of those days where I just laid on the couch all day um, drinking fluids and taking medicine and blowing my nose. Um, but she opened up some packages for me and showed me what was inside while I was laying there to kind of brighten my day. So this one here is from um, Bev and Joe, I believe. Let me get the card out. And I've got the door open so the boys may come and go um, as I'm opening packages. This is the card they sent. Really pretty glittery one. And I'm pretty sure, yes, Joe and Bev. Um, and they sent me these adorable socks. Oh, you just knocked the card on the floor. Look at these cute socks. Aren't they cute? Thank you so much to both of you. Okay, so that was from Bev and Joe. Um, this one is from Jennifer and her daughter, um, Emily. And she sent a card, which is really cute. I thought it was homemade at first, but I don't think it is. But it's really cute. All right, here's the card. Donut look homemade. It's by, is that called? Pep Papyrus? This is such an adorable card. So adorable. Um, and she sent some cute little doggy socks too. And her daughter drew a picture. Oh, it's in the cart. It's in the envelope. Where is the picture? Yes, it's in the envelope. Here's her daughter. And there are two schnauzers. And the schnauzers' names are Gwen and Dodger. Isn't Emily so pretty? I love your long hair, Emily. So pretty. And she drew a picture. This is Merry Christmas. Love, Emily. Isn't that a great picture? It's 
beautiful, Emily. Thank you. She also made an ornament, which one of the eyeballs fell off, Emily. So I've got to glue it back on. Let me, it's in the envelope here somewhere. I kept it in here. She sent this reindeer ornament she made, but as you can see, oh, this one's coming off too. So I'm gonna have to clean, glue the eyeballs back on, Emily, and I'm gonna hang it on the schnauzer tree. So thank you so much for making this. Sometimes when packages get sent, little things like this happen, but don't you worry. I'm gonna make the eyeball stick back on there and we're gonna have it on the tree. <laughs> so thank you, Emily. And they also sent this little keychain too. Isn't this adorable? Thank you guys so much for thinking of me. Okay, let me put this over here. And then we got a package from Sarah. She sent a card. My kid, Merlin is crying. I don't know if you can hear him meowing. I had a package of egg noodles sitting on the counter and he was trying to bite into it and rip the package open and get the egg noodles. He is worse than dogs when it comes to food. Here's the card that Sarah sent. And she said, I might as well just stay standing up. <laughs> Let me move the camera up a little. I don't even know what I look like. Do I look terrible? I just pulled my hair back. Okay, she sent this cute ornament. I have one of these. I still need to re write one of the boys' names on it, but she sent one that says Milo. And she also sent this beautiful Schnauzer coffee cup. Isn't that beautiful? Now look in the side there, best dog. So cute. And then she sent the boys some goodies, some nudges, Soft bakes made with real chicken and blueberries. And then she sent the boys' favorite, which I haven't bought them any of these in a while. Um, so they're going to be happy to get one of these. These Red Barn Bully Slices. They love these things. So thank you so much, Sarah, for the gifts. Okay. And then we have a package from Emily. Emily is who I said she'd be considered the boy's godmother, called a dog mother, because <laughs> she's always so considerate to them and sending little gifts for the boys on their birthday and holidays. Yes, what's in here? They've been sniffing. Let me tell you, they've been sniffing these boxes. They've been sitting on the bench on the end of my bed, and they know there's treats in them, and they've just been sniffing them like crazy, and I said, no, you've got to wait until I share them on video. <laughs> she sent the boys a big hide a squirrel for Christmas. Big log and ton of squirrels in there. Oh yes, you guys can't wait, can you? No. I've got to take the packaging off it though. Okay, I'm going to sit this stuff on the bed. They're probably going to take off with it. Yeah. <laughs> Then she sent them some dog toys that I got them for Christmas. So they're going to be happy. They're all going to get, because I bought a three pack of these. So now there's another three pack. So they'll all get their very own uh, Christmas toy of these. Um, she also sent this reindeer that has like a ball inside of it. So Mickey will love this. Oh yeah, they took off with that big hide of squirrel. <laughs> then she sent this little Christmas toy. They're gonna be stocked up on toys. I'm gonna to have to um, go through their toys and see if there's any ratty ones with holes that I can get rid of. Okay, and then she sent the kitties, these kitty toys. So they're gonna be happy. Yeah, he's out there meowing. He's he's mad because he's in his uh, cage, but he is so terrible. He is so terrible about getting on my counters and ripping into any food I have there. Okay, she sent some blue buffalo doggy treats. These are oatmeal and cinnamon. I'm not going to sit those on the bed. <laughs> no. Some milk bone farmer's medley. They're going to love trying those. I don't think I've ever bought those ones for them. Um, she sent a, this looks like a garden flag. I'm going to 
assuming it's a garden flag. I have not opened it yet. I, maybe I should open it real quick. I'm pretty sure it's a garden flag. Let's see here. And I have a little air, uh, spot outside where I can put it. <laughs> can you see Magnum? No. <laughs> he, his, he had his head laying on the box here. Let's see what this is, Magnum. Oh, maybe it's not a garden flag. Maybe it's an apron. Oh, it's so cute. Look at it. It's so cute. Thank you so much, Emily. I'm glad I opened it. I need Ooh. another apron. I ruined one of mine. Not a schnauzer one, but I ruined one. I'm sorry my head's cut off in most of this video, you guys. I ruined one when I was painting, um, doing my painting. I would just, I was like, I don't care. And I was just wiping paint on my hands on my apron. I still wear it, but it's ruined. It has paint marks all over it now. Okay, then she sent a schnauzer spinner. So we'll put that outside in the spring. Thank you. And she sent this nice blanket, this decorative throw. Okay, let me see if I can show you. I can't wait to open this up. I could have used this last night when I was freezing my butt off. <laughs> um, uh, this uh, Christmas ornament. And I think my daughter said there's six schnauzers on there. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yes, there's six schnauzers on there. So we got to get that open and hang it on the tree. No, no, you leave the kitty toys alone, Milo. And then she sent this schnauzer calendar. Let me open this up. When my daughter was showing it to me, I thought it was a notepad at first. Let's see if I can get this open. Yep. Let's see here. Oops. Oh, this is so cute. Okay, so is this January then? I'm assuming this is January. So they're like little cards and they have each month on it. This is so adorable. And then you just sit them, you switch them and sit them here. Isn't that cute? Let me show up close. Does this say January on it? I don't see where it says the month, but I'm assuming the first one's gonna be January 2020. Well, it says, oh, it says the one up there. Let's see, one, two. Oh yes, get smart, Kim. <laughs> so that's the first month, so January. Isn't this adorable? I love it, thank you. Okay, and then she sent um, these uh, Germac, it's from the Germac Pistachio Company little container of pistachios thank you so much those will be nice to snack on there's also two cards in here she sent one for the family and one for the boys and they're such cute cards oops i think she sent a picture of her lily too yep and there's a picture of her lily isn't she beautiful look at those eyelashes i trim my boys eyelashes you can either leave them or trim them i trim my boys she looks beautiful with hers, doesn't she? So thank you so much, Emily. You're always so kind. I really appreciate it. And I love the apron. Thank you so much. <laughs> all right, let me put all this back in here. And then we'll have to get the ornaments. No, why do you always want kitty toys? Milo always wants kitty toys. I might as well just buy him kitty toys for Christmas because that's all he seems to play with lately. It's kitty toys. Okay, what'd you guys do with that um, tiny squirrel thing? I hope you're not eating the cardboard. You guys, I'm gonna go look for that. I'll be right back. Oh, here it is. Here it is. Look it. You did rip it off. All right, I gotta go find that cardboard piece, guys. <laughs> oh my goodness. You guys, I went out to the um, the schnauzer room, the front room, and I found this. They said, no worries, mom, we'll get the, <laughs> we'll get the packaging off of it. Look at this, you little stinkers. 
Oh my goodness. At least they didn't eat it really. They just kind of ripped it off. Oh my goodness. Okay, let's get to cards. <laughs> let's get to cards here. All right, so we got some cards and I know there's still some more um, at my P.O. box. When I head out after I film this video, I'm gonna um, pick those up. So if you don't see them, your card today, it's probably in my mailbox. So this one is from the Cherry family. It looks like they've got one salt and pepper and one black with white chest like Magnum schnauzer. Adorable. And then this one, I left the note on. It says, Dear Schnauzer Mom, thank you for sharing your boys with us. I wanted to share this card with you. It's a few years old, but shows our adorable girl Tassie who passed away in July. Um, it's from the... Di Dikema family? D-Y-K-E-M-A. I'm so sorry for your loss of Tassie. She's a beautiful girl and thank you so much for sending this to me even though it's a couple years old. She's a beautiful girl. Okay, this one is from Lisa and Zoe. Um, here's the front. And then here is Zoe on the inside in her Christmas gear. <laughs> it's so cute. My boys will not let me put anything on their head. No kind of hats, no reindeer antlers, nothing. They just hang their head in shame. <laughs> this one is from Dave, Mary, Sophie, and Piper. So cute, thank you. This one here is from Erica. Pretty card. Thank you so much, Erica. This one here is from the Millers. No, not the Millers. Karen, fur babies, Stan, rags, and mittens. I'm sorry, I thought mittens said the Millers. I'm a, I apologize, Karen. Thank you so much, so much for the card. Okay, our last card is from Susan and Ron. And it's really cute with penguins on it. So cute. Such cute cards you guys have sent this year. I really appreciate it. Okay, like I said, that's the cards I have so far. I have some in at my P.O. box. What do you want? You want that toy? I have some at my P.O. box I gotta go get today. Um, I haven't been out um, in a couple days, so. Yes, you guys ripped that off. <laughs> Let me, let me rip some squirrels off. Let's get some squirrels off here. Hold on. Hold on. Here, why don't you take this little squirrel? There, you take that. Mozzie, come on. You want up here? You want up here? Let me get these. Oh, yes. Yeah, look at that little squirrel. Yes. Is there any more? Yep, there's one more. <laughs> Hold on. Let me get the little plastic thing off. Hold on. There's a little plastic thing on it. Okay. All right. Let me put them in there. Let me put them in the log. <laughs> Maybe I'll give them a treat too. There you go. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Let's see here. Give them a couple more toys. Bear with me, guys. This this may be boring to some, but let me give them some of their toys. Get this off so you don't eat the cardboard like you did the other ones. Look at this. What's this? What's this, Magnum? What's this? Oh, there's plastic on them. What's this? You want it, Marty? You want it, Marty? There you go. Let's see. Let's give them uh, one of their treats they got. Let's see if they want a bully slice. Yeah. You guys want a bully slice? Who wants a bully slice? Who wants a bully slice? Max is on the floor. I'm gonna give Max this because he's being nice down there. Here you go, Max. Yes, Max is being nice. Here, Mozzie. Here, Marley. Here, Mickey. Here, Milo. There you go. You don't want it? Here. You want it? Here you go. Alright guys, thank you guys all again so much. It's so kind of you guys to think of the boys and me. I really appreciate it. 
Um, hope everybody's having a great week. Um, I'm feeling better, like I said. Hopefully we get this furnace fixed so I'm not freezing to death tonight. And um, we will see you guys in the next video. Bye.